polymorphism the ability to have methods with the same name but different content for related classes the method to use is determined at runtime by the class of the object select new from file menu and select project select visual basic select windows select console application type your project name select the location and create the project System.console.write line displays a line in the console. System.console.read key method obtains the next character or function key pressed by the user. Execute the project. The output is displayed. Copying the required code to create a class person which is the base class. Type or paste the code to create a base class. These are member variables of the base class. These are the member functions of the base class. This is the subroutine of the class person. This is the overridable subroutine of the class person. Overridden members are often used to implement polymorphism. Copying the code to create a class cricket player which is derived from the class person. Type or paste the code to create a class cricket player. Class cricket player is derived from the base class person. Public variable member of the derived class cricket player. Overriding the base class subroutine play. Here the keyword overrides is used. Copying the code to create and initialize the objects. Type or paste the code to create and initialize the objects. Creating an object of the derived class cricket player. Calling derived class version of play. Creating an object of the base class person. Calling base class version of play. Creating a base class object. Initializing it with the derived class object. Calling derived class version of play using base class object. Execute the project. The output is displayed.